And now I would like to introduce you to the 2018 co-class representatives, Olivia George and Grayson Womodorf. Good afternoon, everyone. I am Olivia George. And I'm Grayson Molendorf. And, and we, we are, are the 2018, 2018 Senior Class Co-Presidents. <clears throat> Let me first start off by saying thank you to each and every one of you, family, friends, and faculty for being here. Your support of our education over these past couple of years does not go unnoticed. And you are adored and appreciated by all of us. How about we give them a round of applause? So you're going to hear a lot of speeches today, and I know that after a while, you guys are going to just want us. You guys are wanting. You're, you're going to want us to get our diplomas already. <laughs> Sorry. And while I understand your excitement, as I can't wait to be handed my own diploma, there are many good things to say about the graduating students in this room today. Four years ago, just over 100 young students arrived at Plano ISD Academy High School with a vast amount of opportunity and potential ahead of them. The Academy was new, had a different kind of learning style, and none of us had ever encountered, encountered something this unfamiliar before. And yet, despite the unknown, we all came here. We traded in football games for Ultimate Frisbee and band, choir, and orchestra for project presentations. We took advantage of the opportunities at this school and grew into very smart, hardworking people. And we are leaving the academy with skills, experiences, relationships, and memories that no other school can provide. In this room alone, of just over 100 graduating students, there are future doctors, lawyers, engineers, CEOs, teachers who will inspire future generations, and artists who will inspire the world. We have all grown tremendously and worked very hard to get here. For that, you should all be very proud. Today, our task is simple. Life is vibrant and our spirits are high, as they should be. But come next week, next month, next year, where will we be? How do we maintain our optimism in our days ahead? And my answer to that question would be, I don't know. However, I have no doubt in my mind that we will be able to combat all of the challenges that are about to come our way. College, student debt, taxes, work, and possibly children. Remember tomorrow that today you achieved something truly spectacular. Thank you. Today, I was asked to speak on behalf of the students and in some ways define the Plano Academy class of 2018. Each one of us is a brain, an athlete, a basket case, a princess, and a criminal. Wait, <laughs> that's the wrong speech. <laughs> to define these students would be almost impossible. See, over the years, each of us have learned that we are more than what fits the stereotype of an Academy student. This school has defined us as engineers or scientists, but within our own community, we can define that we are the most diverse of students out there. We have our own makeup artists, golfers, frisbee players, dancers, and so much more. And that brings me to community and the opportunities we have received as a tight-knit class. Over the past four years, we as students have been given so many opportunities to speak within our community and about our community. Personally, I believe that without this school, we would have not been able to speak our minds and express a want for change. This school is change and is always changing for the better, but change couldn't have happened if the school didn't believe that we as students are the future. And that, I would say, is the greatest thing about our community. It's not just the students, but the facilitators, administration, and parents that have put so much support into what we are today and what we will become tomorrow. Never in my life would I have thought that I would be standing here giving a speech about my fellow friends and classmates. And this is the part of my speech where it might get a little sentimental, sorry. What is a high school speech without quoting high school musical? <laughs> 
As Troy Bolton said in High School Musical 3, high school is a place where one person, if it's the right person, changes us all. In this case though, I am lucky and grateful to say that this school was a place where we all impacted each other. Because change happened when we chose to go to this school. Change happened when we built those robots in iTitan. Change happened when we made submarines in Beneath the Surface. Change happened when we fought over Somalians in Kaching. Change happened when we worked endless hours with Ms. Paquette on perfecting our capstone. Change happened. And every moment we had together in groups, projects, clubs, and more will be remembered and cherished forever. See, it was never about the decision to choose a school that was untraditional, but it was the choice to be a part of something different and to be part of a close community, or rather I say, to be part of a family. And it's these memories and relationships that define us as the Plano Academy class of 2018.